people leaving the workforce because I feel like it's like that breaking point. It's like the straw that broke the camel's back where they're finally ready to be like, I'm going to jump and there isn't a net, but I'm going to hope that I can find one or make one. Mm. And so it's do you, really... How do you think they're going to do? I hope that they're going to do great because you I... And I both hope they're going to do yeah. great. But like really look into the future yeah. because I think that you have a unique uh, voice that yeah. people can really hear. Yeah. I think a lot of the people that are going to jump yeah. or that have jumped, they crash. Yeah. How do you help them build back up? Because it, it's survivable, but yeah. they're going to need tools. So I feel like when people are jumping, it's my first indicator that they're actually listening to themselves, right? Like they're finally at their wit's end or they're finally at the place where they're like, I don't care mm. that there's no boat there. I'm going to go. So to me, that's a really good indicator that they're finally coming home to themselves or like getting honest with themselves. But it is really scary because it's like, do you have the right tools in your toolbox to build up what's next? Or do you have the belief? One thing that you and I did and continue to do is like, if we don't know how to do something, we, we learn, right? 